So, um, I'm Shanika again from Polgoya Putri. Uh, this is the Chromati Hobbitech 40 again uh, with the different control this time. Um, so, right, let's look at the thing first. So, this, this has been um, fully reconditioned by our engineer. These are brand new elements, thermocouple. Uh, these elements must be seasoned to 1100 centigrade. As you can see, the overall condition is, um, is excellent. I have put bad wash on the floor. Uh, sometimes I do that, sometimes I don't. But it's, it's advisable to do that uh, in case you drop any kind of liquid, especially glaze. Uh, I also painted this with hammerite, red, not hammerite, sorry, oxide. And the ceramic lid is here. And as you can see, it's, it's had, it had very light use. This is the kiln who, um, which I bought from a person uh, who claimed it has been fully reconditioned by a well-known engineer who I'm not going to be naming. Um, but he's done whole thing quite completely wrong which is why I took it to my engineer and he's done it all absolutely correct now and uh, basically what they done was put 3.5 5 sorry 3.5 kiln element into this kiln and put a plug 13 amp plug which is completely wrong what we did was what our engineer did was put normal 3 kilowatts elements and put the new plug as well and um, he's tested it and electrical test certificate will be provided as well so when you lift the kiln lid you will have to press this and lift the kiln lid this is where the controller is going to be plugged in right this is a pottery craft controller st 3300 with one program right to plug this controller you need to match these two two, uh, two screws as you can see lift this up plug it in secure it and then you can you can plug the kiln into a 13 amps main socket All right the kiln is switched off at the moment from the controller to switch the control on that's it there it's our thermocouple. Don't plug this controller into any other kiln, please, or anything else that you might think. Right. To start a program, we go with this one. Okay. PN program 1. Pass, which is the delay. If you wanted to delay, you can press up arrow. If you don't want, low arrow. Step again. That's going 199 degrees per hour. If you want to reduce it, you go this way. Low arrow. If you want to increase it, you go this way step again that's 600 degrees top temperature of ramp number one step again we are not dwelling at 600 degrees step again that's going 380 degrees as i said lower upper you can increase or decrease step again that's going second ramp thousand degrees top temperature you can increase that temperature by putting this arrow or the arrow lower step again you will uh, will you like to dwell or soak at thousand degrees if you would like to dwell at that temperature you press up arrow for let's say 10 minutes or whatever minute if you don't want you just go this arrow or pass and then if you press the step button again that's the end of that program number one if you want to want that program to start you press that button twice it will come up as soon as you hear that click the kiln is on and you will see this button is illuminated in red and that's as simple as that and there will be instruction manual provided for this one which you can read at home and i can i can provide you plenty of um, demonstration so you know how to use the kiln controller that's really simple and there is a mounting bracket here which you can mount it on the wall there we are Please don't put this controller on the top of the kiln, please, because it will melt. That's really about it with this kiln. And if you come this way, many. This way. Yeah. It's, it's um, as you can see, the engineer certified it 3 kilowatts now, not 3.5. There. There is 3 kilowatts here. That's it. There. 3 kilowatts 1300 maximum temperature 
okay and this is the certification and i will be providing you with another uh, paper certificate which the engineer has provided um i have um, painted it with um, red oxide there was a bit of peeling um that's about it with this one it's really simple to use this one thank you very much for watching if you have any questions please let me know bye